fidèle à ses principes, a tout mis en œuvre pour cette présidence du G20. First of all, please allow me to thank Prime Minister Modi, faithful to his principles. India did its utmost for its presidency of the G20 to serve unity and peace and also send across a message of unity while Russia is still waging its war against Ukraine. So here I would like to thank Prime Minister Modi and say once again, France stands alongside India. Over the years uh, with uh, Prime Minister Modi, we've had many conversations on uh, both of those issues. Uh, obviously, Canada will always defend uh, freedom of expression, freedom of conscience, uh, freedom of uh, peaceful protest. That's something that's extremely important to us. At the same time, as we're always there uh, to prevent violence, to uh, push back against hatred. I think on the issue. Of, uh, of the community, it's important to remember that the actions of the few do not represent the entire community or Canada. Um, on the flip side of it, we also uh, highlighted the importance of respecting the rule of law and uh, we did talk about foreign interference. to thank His Excellency Prime Minister Modi for the gracious hospitality that was shown to my personal self, my spouse and my entire Turkish delegation. And I would like to uh, extend my gratitude to all of those involved in the realization of this summit. I was about to cry. It was a great emotion for me, because actually we thought that there was going to be a debate and then a decision would be taken. But at the very beginning of the summit, it was announced that we were a member.